Okay, so for those of you who are not familiar with pickleball, um, it's pretty similar to tennis, uh, except for you're using a wiffle ball and you use a flat paddle. Um, so it doesn't have any holes or like any um, little gaps in it like a racket does for tennis. Um, pickleball, the best way for me to describe it is like, uh, it's like playing ping pong on the ground. So like giant ping pong. Um, basically it's got similar rules to tennis, um, but it's a little bit different in a couple ways. One of them being that the ball moves a lot slower. So because it has the little air holes in it, when you're hitting it back and forth, it looks like it's going fast, but the air kind of slows it down as it travels through those holes. Um, and then the rules are a little bit different in terms of like boundaries and serving and points. Um, those are all a little bit different from tennis. Um, but for the most part, it's tennis with a wiffle ball. Um, so you're still hitting the ball back and forth. You can play either one-on-one -on -one or you could play doubles. Um, and really the scoring is similar to tennis, but using different numbers. So like same kind of system, just different numbers um, that you're scoring in. Overall, so though, pickleball is a really good source of cardio. Um, you'll see in the videos, you're doing a lot of running back and forth. You're doing a lot of agility. Um, so a lot of like rapid change of direction, um, a lot of footwork to maneuver to the ball, especially when you're playing singles. Um, you move a lot more because you're in charge of the entire court rather than, you know, one section of it when you're playing doubles. Um, but yeah, it really involves a lot of hand-eye coordination. It involves a lot of cardio, um, speed, um, and it's just a really good way to get a workout in. I didn't think it was going to be that hard. I've watched my dad play it for the last couple of years and he competes. Um, and I've always kind of said like, oh, it doesn't look that hard. But um, it takes a lot out of you, honestly. If anything, I think it might be harder than tennis. So um, it's definitely a sport you have to work for. But it's definitely a good time. see uh, between myself and my dad's uh, doubles partner Robert who he's playing singles with in the video is Robert has really quick hands Robert also has really fast feet and no matter how athletic you are like my dad plays with um, a huge range of people so ex-NFL players ex-NBA you know you name it but regardless of how athletic you are um, it really does take a long time to build up that skill if you don't already have it. So unless you play a sport like tennis or baseball or ping pong, it's kind of a game that you have to learn as you go. Um, and I played tennis growing up, so I do have a little bit of that hand-eye coordination. I played softball, so it's not new to me, but definitely like the movement and having to go back and forth and move so quickly in such a short uh, distance is a little weird to me. Jeez, Megan. Nice shot.